All right, guys. It is a balmy, sticky summer night here in December. 66 degrees here at 10 o'clock at night here in the uh, shithole of Austin, Texas, uh, where I am wrapped up with another <clears throat> weekend of hell in the Christmas tree lot from hell. I am fucking believable. Heading back to Garfield, Texas. <clears throat> that would be Sunday night, December 8th, 2019. Uh, so uh, I have to get back to Garfield and <clears throat> get back into my deepening depression curl up in a fetal position and wait for the cold gray winter to return although I think we're looking at 80 degrees I think we have one more 80 degree day on December 9th <clears throat> before winter time finally gets here but anyway of course what is on my mind tonight is I head back to Garfield like I'm sure if you have a YouTube channel i uh, probably been wondering the same thing about whether the axe is getting ready to fall. Uh, <clears throat> is the axe getting ready to fall on your YouTube channel? And uh, looks like we have the police stayed out tonight. <clears throat> Jesus, someone else's night is ruined. So, I've been studying uh, this and talking to people and <clears throat> trying to dig down, figuring out whether or not I am going to have a YouTube channel on Tuesday, December 10th. I guess I will know on uh, Wednesday, December 11th, whether my channel gets pulled down. I'm actually not, I'm not as worried as I was 24 hours ago uh, for a <clears throat> for a few different reasons of course this this terminology that's scaring everybody is if you did it's not just YouTube is Google uh, there's your first can this is bigger than YouTube this is the Google uh, you, you know our uh, our overlords at Google who, you know, YouTube is just one of their many tentacles. So anyway, it's this language that is being used in this new YouTube terms of service about if they determine you are not commercially viable, not commercially viable, that they reserve the right to yank down your channel and of course this is the big question is trying to figure out what the you know second guess these uh, algorithms <clears throat> what the hell is how do these YouTube algorithms d determine whether your YouTube channel is commercially viable so one thing that I've been hearing is if your channel is on the chopping block that you might have received this weird email that they were sending apparently they've been sending out this email to a lot of channels you know pointing this out uh, talking about these new changes and that they reserve to yank down your channel if you know I have never received this email I've received no emails whatsoever on Collapse Chronicles. And here on Humpty Dumpty Tribe, you know, I've been hearing all of this shit about if you have kids in your video. I think this is something different, but if you do have a lot of children in your video, that could be a bad sign for your channel. But I don't have any kids in either of my video, uh, either of my channels. I. I've been getting some weird emails about their new comments policy 
on Humpty Dumpty Tribe that I've talked about that I <clears throat> have not had this new policy uh, inflicted upon me on uh, Collapse Chronicles. Uh, so I don't think it has anything to do with the uh, content of your comments uh, and it doesn't sound like what I'm hearing that it's that it doesn't even have have much to do with whether or not your channel is monetized uh, and, and in fact the way I'm reading these tea leaves that if you think because your channel is monetized that you're not going to be chopped uh, you could be deluding yourself <clears throat> so what I what I am digging up and anybody can weigh in on this is that one definition that I have heard uh, about whether your channel is is more likely to get ripped down on Tuesday is there's two things that you need to look for number one does your channel have at least 1,000 subscribers? That That is the first thing these algorithms are going to be looking for, is a minimum of 1,000 subscribers. Well, I've got 7,300 on Humpty Dumpty Tribe and, what, 3,500 on Collapse Chronicles. That's the number one thing. So, uh, if you do not have a thousand, you know, obviously the fewer the subscribers that you have, if you're putting out videos and nobody is subscribing to your channel, that could be a sign you're fucked. And then the other one that I have heard <clears throat> is in the past 12 months, has your channel had 4,000 hours of view time. I'm not hearing that it's the number of views as much as they want to know how much time people are listening to your channel and somehow they've come up with 4,000 hours over the last 12 months. 4,000 hours, I think 4,000 times 60 is 240,000. I think 4,000 hours is 240,000 minutes. Look at this fucking idiot. Uh, <clears throat> God damn, learn how to fucking drive, you goddamn asshole. So, uh, what you need to do to find this out if you don't know how to do this is you need to you know go scroll down you know find your channel and go on your analytics you go on your channel analytics figure out how to do that in your channel and go look at the analytics for the last 12 months they do mine in minutes so uh, it's, so the, the magic number you're looking for is 240,000. So if your channel has more than 4,000 hours or 240,000 minutes, however they phrase it, you're probably out of the, the danger zone. So I am way, way above, uh, I think I'm, I, I, I don't know, I'm into the millions or whatever. So I'm, I am not that concerned because I have, A, I have way over 1,000 subscribers, B, I have well over uh, 4,000 hours of view time in the last 12 months, and C, I have not received this email specifically you know talking that they reserve the right to pull down your channel if it's determined that it's not commercially viable so uh, <clears throat> but uh, if you have received that email you have less than 1,000 subscribers and you have less than 4,000 minutes of view time on your videos in the last 12 months <clears throat> and we'll throw in you're not monetized 
I and I know that uh, does pertain to uh, probably several people listening to this video. Uh, all I can say is I've been uh, emailing some of you saying if uh, if you don't survive the purge, it's been nice knowing you on YouTube. Uh, and I really hope that this does not affect any of uh, my friends down here in the Doomosphere. Uh, that would, uh, <clears throat> that'll be a sad day because uh, if my friends get their YouTubes yanked down, YouTube channels yanked down for being non-commercially viable. <clears throat> Anywho's, we shall know soon enough, I guess, on Wednesday, we will know, and, and once again, I keep putting out this warning, <clears throat> if, my, if, if my channel, uh, if Humpty Dumpty Tribe disappears, and it's no longer on YouTube on Wednesday, I will, I have already set up the Hambone Little Tail channel at Vimeo.com, now, since I'm not worried about collapse, it's not, there, there, there's a Humpty Dumpty tribe on Vimeo that is not me. It's the Hambone Little Tail channel, and uh, if, they, if those sons of bitches take down Collapse Chronicles, well, obviously, uh, we'll be uh, starting a new Collapse Chronicles channel over at Vimeo.com, uh, though I'm not really worried about it. So, anyway, I'm wishing... I'm wishing my small channel brethren down here in the Doomosphere sending out uh, peaceful, loving vibes and uh, hope you, we're all here together on, uh, on Wednesday. But with that, I'm getting ready to make my turn into Garfield, Texas. And I need to pay attention to my damn driving. Bye, guys.